Alright. So, during the break, I noticed that, um... Uh, it says we're in 2300 AD, even though actually nowhere in the game did it say we were in 2300 AD. So... Uh, how do we know this? We know it because the game tells us. The do game. not question the game. Alright. Maybe there's some NPC you never talked to. It's just like, by the way, here's a calendar. Oh, thank you. <laughs> uh, that's the sewer access. We're not going that way. I don't like that place. It's boring. I really gotta get a different emulator. This one is... Maybe I'll go back to SNEX 9X. SNES 9X. Snicks. Anyway, here's Jonathan's favorite part of the game. Yes! So that's just the cool music. Mid comic. That's my favorite part of the game. <laughs> Are you ready to ride this bike through the ruins? Hold because... on a second. What? Oh no! Robots attacking! Robots saying swear words. F. F. Uh, or not. <gasps> Hold it right there. Hey, I get oh. to see these lines. Okay, you can you can read it. Hey, it's the man! <sighs> Hey. Like, thanks for the intro, babe. That doesn't sound like Elvis at all. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoa, like, uh, thanks for the intro, babe. There you go. The man! <laughs> <laughs> you low lives can call me Johnny. Johnny! <sighs> now listen up, partner. I mean, <laughs> now you're just turning into Ron. Part of an old... Highway runner leads through this room. Think you can beat me in a bike race? There you go. You that jet there, jet bike, and don't chicken out, babe. Oh, yeah. You're right, I do. Alright, so here's how you ride. Mode 7 time! Ooh! So you go along, basically you just kind of rotate back and forth. With you and Johnny here. Johnny. And you get three turbo boosts, but you only really need one right at the end. Because if you use a turbo boost, then you just have Wah! Turbo! But then you, like, catch it up immediately. So it's pointless. I usually just spin around in the whole time, kind of like what you're doing. Right. So, you, you try to want to kind of stay ahead most of the time, but just basically at the, you just time it so at the very end you uh, get the boost at the right time. Coming up. Oh, I didn't even use the boost. Nice, no one. Nice. <laughs> Are we ready for amazing Super Nintendo graphics? Whoa! It's like Super Mario Kart. Isometric. Whoa! Isometric? I don't know. That's I'm totally making, not what it is. I'm making up words. It's Actually, I'm seven. using words incorrectly. Mode 7, dude. Flat 3D. Which uh, is <laughs> seems oxy like an oxymoron. All right, Johnny. You beat me. I don't get it. You can now. I sound like Obama. <laughs> you can challenge me any time. We'll ride the wind, babe. For America. <laughs> I don't know if that's racist or not, because he is the only black character in the game. He's I wasn't Obama. saying that because of. I'm saying it because that's how I sound. <laughs> well, there you go. That's 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 the best character in the game, according to John. No, he just got my name. That's and true. it's an awesome bike race. And usually you don't beat it the first time. I did. Well, now. <laughs> I don't remember if I did the very first time I ever played. I might have. Oh. Probably did. Oh, buggers. I mean, yeah, they're buggers. Oh, buggers. Come on, guys. Get close enough so I can cycle them. Stop Do zapping. It. Do it now. Apparently chat wants us all to play FTL. What? Because the music during the break made them think of FTL. What is FTL? Stands for Faster Than Light. It's a game that exists that I don't know anything about. Ooh, Chrono I mean, learns. it does sound like a thing I want. Look, we just learned some text. Hypno Wave. I, I now know of Slash and Hypno Wave. Slash Flea and Ozzy. Hypno Wave never works, though. It's one of those dumb things. It's supposed to, like, put enemies to sleep. 
but it never actually does. I'll show you. I'll put these robots to sleep. Wouldn't you be putting them in the dormants? Maybe if you use it on something that's not a robot. You probably just <laughs> you probably just tried it here one time and it was like this doesn't work. Yeah, if you can figure out what creatures Hypnowave works on, and that I use them on it and it works, I will give, give you, you XP. Uh, oh. I'll give you, Doodler, a uh, ginger ale. Oh, why, that would be lovely. I've never had a ginger ale from you like the one I currently have. It's Verner's, but I'm still hungry. Not me! Hold on. I guess that made me not thirsty, not not hungry. Hey, look, it's the Doodler! What he, the? He's broken. Oh! It's I a mean, robot. It's, it is a robot. I'm sure he's not integral to a plot. What's this? And Chrono's like, who cares? Let's just slash it. Like we've done with every other robot. <laughs> it's in bad shape. It appears to be humanoid or robot. Incredible! I mean, these robots not shaped like humans, you know, a dime a dozen. But... But this thing... Top notch. I think I can fix it. What? What? It might attack us! No, no, no. I'll make sure it won't. Machines aren't capable of evil. Humans make them that way. Yeah. Humans are jerks. Who got you? That's an ethical thing they're telling us. You pity them, don't you? Uh, let me get to work now, okay? No, I love them. I am. She kind of does. That's why she never ends up with Chrono again. Oh, I, uh, sorry, I spoiled that. <laughs> what a spoiler! Right, the, that the nerdy sci scientist character doesn't end up with the main hero. <laughs> Imagine that. Hold on. Here we go. Ready? Ready? Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna. <coughs> I'm sorry. That's like Desert you. What was the third song that went with this? I don't remember. Oh, wasn't it your mute one of your songs? That might have been. Maybe it was the one that sounded like FDL. Good morning. Mall. Mo. Never gonna. Never gonna. Good morning, mistress. What is your command? Not your mistress. It's Paris the thought. I'm moral. <laughs> this is Chrono. He doesn't say anything. And Luca here fixed you. Understood. Adam Luca fixed me. Zappity zappity. Uh, just Luca will do. I'm not French. There are no madams or mistresses here, I'm afraid. Impossible. That would be rude. <laughs> so, Luca didn't program this robot to be uh, mean, but then objects to everything that he does. <laughs> uh, uh, look. I hate formal titles, don't you, Marl? She just got it working again, okay, and made sure it wasn't evil. Hate him! I understand. Oh, she just took out the evil chip, not the, um, <laughs> don't be rude chip. Here's your problem, yeah. This doll's switched to evil. <laughs> Alright, now what's your name? Name, ah, uh, my serial number, it is R66-Y. R66-Y? Cool! No, oh, that won't do at all. I'm a princess. I get to make decisions. Come on, Chrono. Let's give him a better name. Fine. His name is Robo. We have to name everything you come across. But I am tempted to give him a, a different name. What Robot. Do you no, what do you think if we name him this? Oh, this better not... Oh. Listen, I have done this before. I know. And it never ends well. <laughs> it ends exactly the same. Oh, you're right. It doesn't really make a difference. Should I name him R66Y chat or should I go back to Robo? Or should I name him Butts? <laughs> I'm not going hey, to name him Butts. Hey, stop doing that. You're making me <laughs> laugh and so I'm screwing up my drawing. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll try to be more boring in the future. Yeah, well, you won't have to try that hard. Should I name him Butts? I'm boring. Imagine yourself saying it every time he's mentioned. Butts. Butts. Or are you talking about R66Y?
It's not hard for you to imagine saying the word butts all the time. Name him Doddler, because Doodler doesn't fit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Diddle. I'll just name him Mars 6 y I unless, guess. unless somebody objects in chat in the next 10 seconds. Which, Five, since, since chat four, is on a delay, it's probably not going to happen. I said 10 seconds. Okay, I'm five. I was going to go back into the negatives. <laughs> I don't think that's how it works. It's how I works. Hold on. I'm, um, take, I'm taking a drink of Crush as chat. Mm -hmm. so. He's got a crush on that soda. It is delicious. I'm not naming him Doddler, although you are strangely prescient. Who, me? No, chat. R66Y? That's perfect! That's my favorite. She's like, R66Y sucks. And then R66Y is perfect. Your new name is R66Y, okay? I am R66Y. That sounds Sports better company. than the name before. Robo is a dumb name. Hey, R66Y, why aren't there any people here? Uh, I killed them all, and now I will kill you too. Laser beams, probably. But what has happened here? There were many humans and others of my kind in this dome. Screaming the caps. I think something awful happened here. Yes, probably. It would appear so. But how is it that you survived? We came through a time warp from the year 1000, obviously. That sounds sin plausible. <laughs> <laughs> well, exploring Airstone, we learned there was a gate here. We found you when we came looking for the gate. But the door to the inner chamber just locked, so we're out of luck. No, look up after the stream's over, chat. Look up the um the Rick Roll slash Robo theme on YouTube. The mashup's pretty good. The power is off. We go to the factory up north. I can pass through security and activate the stone generator. I'm like an Elcor. Mass effect. You that's for us? Yeah, oh, whoa! He's up going all Tarzan on us. You repaired me. Now it is my turn to help you. Excitedly. Sadly. But the generator won't run for long. So someone must stay behind to open the door of all the powers on. Marla, I will stay. Okay, so who's going to stay behind? Marl or Luca? Uh, um, we'll let Chad also weigh in on this. Luke is the useful one. Well, Marl's got the healing. But Marl's Luke, the useful one. But Luca's got the fire magic, which is more potent. Luca's the potent one. Whereas Marl is the impotent one. That's not true. I love how it doesn't even give you a choice for Chrono. Like, Chrono could stay behind, but he's like, Nah, I'm the protagonist. I get to go. <laughs> Maybe when I'm older. Robo will start healing soon. Um, but he hasn't yet. Ditch the dits. <laughs> so, <laughs> chat votes for Marl staying behind. What do you say, doodler? Yeah. Alright. Because of Robo malfunctions, we need the, the guy, the girl to protect him. Please be careful, Chrono. All right. I mean, repair them. Right. That's called sleep in the Anertron. Except for Robo. The Robo. No, no, he's still hungry too. He eats chips. He Get eats it. Energon cubes. <laughs> Microchips. They're like normal chips, but smaller. <laughs> Oh, well, this reminds me, if somebody did a, a mashup drawing online that you can look up, it's Chronorama or something like that. It's the cast of Futurama as oh, yeah, mashed I, up with the cast of Chrono Yeah, I, I saw that the other day. It's good. And Robo, of course, is Bender. <laughs> right. And I would just love them to do a mod of this game where <laughs> Robo is Bender and everybody is that type of character. <laughs> Am I sneaking? Speaking about Futurama jokes. My gosh, what are you, what are you eating? It's I'm like, eating a drumstick. It's like you haven't been in it. You're eating a drumstick like a giant piece of a chicken? Mm-hmm. Override security system, zero, zero. Made of chocolate. Oh no, it's the security acid. <laughs> it's one of them. However, will we survive? Well, 
good thing the swords cut right through acid. Wait, how does that make any sense? It just does. All right. So you don't technically have to go down this elevator, but we're going to because uh, I need to grind at least a little bit in this game. So let's get to grinding. But first, I'm going to hit a bunch of buttons in nowhere. So I think there's like a chest or something hidden behind the map. There it is. Girl's not a ditz. She's just misunderstood. Uh, misunderstood. Well, she's kind of compared to Luca, though. Everybody's a ditz, especially Lisa. <laughs> but especially Bart. I, I forget which way I'm actually supposed to go down here, so I might be running around nowhere for a bit. No, I think I was going the right way. There we go. Robin bow. I'll put that right on Marlin. Oh, right. I really need to get into a, a different emulator. This one's lagging my sphere speed. Uh oh. We've been grabbed by the claw. The claw? It's... We, we have been chosen. <laughs> I was going to make a Zelda reference. Oh, that, that hand that always comes and gets you. Oh, the, uh, the, was it the wall master or the floor master? I always forget which. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's the thing we use to clean our kitchen. Oh, what? To use a giant disembodied hand to clean the kitchen? No, it's the floor master. It's a special vacuum. And yes, I use a giant hand. I should probably like use a tech on this guy. What does what does R six six Y have in terms of techniques? I don't even remember. Electro or something or other? Uh, I think he's got like a rocket punch or something. Alright, right. Well, let's find out in the next fight. Conveyor belt. In the next exciting episode of Dragon this Ball next... Z. Wow! <laughs> yeah, that did sound good. Like it all makes sense. Let's do a fire world right on that. Here you go, chat. Which is better, Dragon Ball Z or this? If you answer Dragon Ball Z, you're wrong. <laughs> well, Chrono basically is just Goku with red hair. Yeah. And Luca is Bulma. And Robo is clearly Vegeta. Wait, what? <laughs> I don't really know much about that show. I'm surprised I remembered who Vegeta was. And that's only because of the over 9,000 clip, really. All the Saiyans are named after vegetables. We just learned Rocket Roll! Rocket Roll. Rocket Roll. Stuffy now. All right, here we go. Let's try out rocket roll. That kills everybody. Oh. I think this might be a part where that will upload because it's a it's a password part. Yay! Here's a part that is things. So first we shall get boxes with nothing terribly exciting in them. Okay. <clears throat> Remember this. Remember the clue. Crane control code. Code zero. X A. Code one. B B. Also robots to fight. Boop 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 boop. We're gonna put this part back on. Welcome back, Sir Watts. We just did a whole part that we're not gonna upload. But this part we will because we're using the crane. Or the claw, I guess. So it was XA. Bing bong. Can you remember the other one? Remember the clue. Uh, this one picks up a barrel. Guess what the other one does? Can you guess? Nothing stupid. <laughs> You're so stupid. I wish there was like an Easter egg in here. Like you press like L and Y and Seven. A and 
something, and then it like picked up a teddy bear and gave it to you. That's the dumbest Easter egg I've ever heard of. Or it picked up an Easter egg, an actual literal like Easter egg, and it was painted with bunnies and chocolate. It was painted with moos. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Aren't those characters called moos in the game? M-U? Oh, N-U, news. Oh, news. All right, the little blue dudes? Yeah. yeah they're news. Anyway, so now we'll follow that path and meet you there. I have fought enough and I shall fight no more forever. Ooh. A million bucks to anyone can name who said that. I got a bolt sword. This reminds him of Zelda. It is a Super Nintendo game. So that's probably why it reminds you of a Super Nintendo game. No, there must be another reason. A deeper reason. Alright, so this screen says Last Defense Lock code named Zaby. Translation, X-A-B-Y. Get it? I understand. That's... Oh, that's X-A-B-Y. <laughs> Thanks. Once again, that wonder is 1-800-X-A-B-Y. That's 1-800-X-A-B-Y. <laughs> Once wow, again, that's one my name. My name again is Mr. Plow. Mr. Zaby. Okay, so we're now going down this side of things, which leads us to. Oh, to look. what? What could it possibly lead us to? A oh. save points! Extreme algebra before your game. 